Gentlemen, come here. Legend has it that if you drop one of these on this video, it will automatically make you 27.8% better looking. What do you say? You want to give it a try? All right, ready? On the count of three. Everybody, one, two, three, and drop. It worked, gentlemen. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, baby. Something else I'm talking about in order to keep you as good looking as possible. Today, I'm going over 10 things that good looking guys never wear. The first thing that good looking guys never wear are Uncle Barry undies. <laughs> So picture it, there you are, Saturday night, you're out at the club, you see some fine ass super sassy senorita and you're like, yo mama, you wanna get out of here? She's like, absolutely. She's like, hey, let's go to your place. They're like, nah, I got roommates, AKA your mom and dad, let's go to yours. You go back to her place, you start making out a little bit, one thing leads to another, she starts like unbuttoning your shirt, she rips your pants off, and you're standing there rocking your best berries. Gentlemen, here's the deal, if you wanna ensure that nights like that actually end a little more sexily, is sexily even a word? <laughs> it is today, you need to make sure that your underwear game is also as equally strong as your super sexy outerwear. The second thing good looking guys never wear are toms with, well, well, with anything. What? You're gonna get me? Okay, fine. Toms are awesome. Wear them with everything. Toms are incredible. Tom <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, the third thing that good looking guys never wear are big baggy long sleeve t-shirts. So I love a long sleeve tee. A good long sleeve tee. But just like their short sleeve counterpart, you gotta make sure it fits you flawlessly. It looks incredible. It's got a little edge, a little attitude. This is a perfect example of an amazing long sleeve tee that just takes your style and your looks to the next level. It's from Cuts. They are today's video sponsor. If you dig this, guys, it comes in a lot of fun colors. I'll link to it down below. Here's another example of an amazing long sleeve t-shirt. It's a light, like super soft, like purple, which I absolutely love. Very like springtime fresh, all right? It's strategically snug in all the right places across the chest, the arms, but it's not like skin tight in the body making you look like a sausage. Another detail of this long sleeve tee that just makes it sexier than your classic long sleeve tee is the hem. Instead of a straight box guys it's got a little detail a little more attitude a little flair at the bottom and that is one of the reasons why you are going to freaking love the company cuts all of their shirts you get to choose three different neck options you've got crew you've got V and you've got Henley and then for the bottom the hems you've also got three different options to choose from you've got elongated you've got curved and you've got split you guys are going to freak out over cuts like I did guys the clothing fits amazing the fabric is super buttery soft and the styling is ridiculous not to mention the fit. Guys, I'm going to link the cuts down below. If you go through our link, there's also going to be a discount code. They've got t-shirts, they've got long sleeve shirts, and they are perfection. And they've also got a new collection that just came out with some new springtime colors that are all soft and amazing, which brings us to the fourth thing that stylish, good looking guys never do, and that is forget to wear a little color. Good looking men know that they cannot exist on black alone, even though black is amazing and makes you look dark, mysterious and sexy. Guys, it is critical that you bring a little color into your wardrobe. There's nothing that makes a guy look better than when he's not afraid to experiment and express himself through using different colors that most dudes aren't willing to. Good looking guys aren't afraid to explore and try different colors. Guys, here's the thing. You've got to be willing to step outside of your box. Now, I know that I am a huge fan of black and grays, but every time, every single time that I wear a shirt that's a little bit outside of the box like this, guys, in terms of color, I automatically get more compliments than when I'm wearing like the black. And right now, guys, if you hit our link, they're going to give you a special deal at checkout. It's going to automatically come off of the purchase price, but you got to hurry because they always sell out of the super like sexy colors. They got some new ones back in stock, some old ones that you guys are going to freaking love that have been out of stock. Guys, hit the link down below. I am telling you, once you try a cut shirt, you're not going to wear anything else because these bad boys fit you flawlessly. They look amazing and they are are super soft, sexy, and you are going to love them. The fifth thing the good looking dudes don't wear are tank tops. Now I know that I'm breaking a few muscular hearts out there. One exception would be the gym. If you want to go to the gym and rock a tank top, I say do it. But the reason why you never want to wear it out in public is that other people think that you think you're the shit. But you are the shit, so what does it matter is probably what you're thinking. It's what I'm thinking for you because you are the shit. But the deal is this. You gotta make sure when you're a good looking dude that you don't draw too much attention because attention is already coming at you. The other reality is that you don't need to wear a tank top when you're wearing a strategically fitted t-shirt in order to let everybody else know, yo mama, I'm the man. The sixth thing that good looking guys do not wear ever under any circumstances are white 
ankle socks. So I'm not a huge fan of white socks, including like no-show socks, unless like the interior lining of your shoes are white, I would say they're better options. In my opinion, you should always try to match either your skin tone or the internal lining of your shoe. Under no circumstances do the white quarter high socks look good. They don't look good with sneakers, they don't look good with shorts, they don't look good with toms, they don't look good with boat shoes, they are horrible. The seventh thing that good looking guys never wear is what I call the ridiculous roll. All right, so let me show I mean, let me show you what I'm talking about. All right, so there's a fine line between a cuff and a roll. If your pants look like this, that means that your pants are too long and should not be cuffed. Instead, and this is how a good looking dude cuffs his pants. It's small, it's minimal, it's clean, it's not too big, it's not too fat, and it's not a ridiculous roll. The eighth thing that good looking guys never wear is a one note denim outfit. If you are going to wear denim on denim, whether or not it's a denim jacket on jeans or a denim shirt on jeans you got to make sure it's not one note and what I mean by one note is that they match all right you want to make sure that there is a high contrast but I could wear this jacket and make it look sexy as hell if I wore a darker pair of denim notice the high degree of contrast if it's one note it's got to go and I think the good-looking guys never wear are shoes that scream look at me look at me look at me look at me Good-looking dudes know that the shoes should not be the star of the show, more like supporting characters, all right? You need to make sure that the shoes that you are wearing are stylish and work in a cohesive, stylish manner with the rest of your outfit. Now, you may be asking yourself, Alpha, where did you get Toms and those ugly-ass Gucci shoes? And the answer is, I bought them for me at one point in my style journey. Which brings us to the 10th and final thing that good looking guys do not wear, or it's more like they do not do, which is forget to evolve, stylistically speaking. All right, it is very important for you as a good looking, stylish man to evolve. It's important to try things, different things, in order to see what you like, what you don't like. And at one point in my life, I was like, yo, I think Tom's might be sick. I got him and I'm like, I can't wear these. And then I bought these, cause they were comfortable. And I'm like, yo, you look like a douche. And I do. Good looking guys know it is important to try different things and evolve stylistically speaking. Sometimes you're going to try something. You're going to be like, yo, this is incredible. I look amazing. And you rock it. And sometimes you buy Toms and you don't.